What's going on YouTube? Noah Five Ash back with another road back to a thousand here today. We are out here. Uh, we traveled from uh, Deglo over in Michigan. We are now in Maine. Uh, beautiful out here. Great drive. It was about I think it was over 15 hours. We knocked about six hours off uh, Sunday. Maybe less, like four to four to six hours on Sunday. And then we. Uh, <clears throat> Woke up the next day, Holly Holly knocked out two hours, and then I got the rest of the, the eight hours. So it wasn't a bad drive, beautiful. Uh, but yeah, we, we finally made it. We're out here at Pineland Farms. Pretty sure is the name of this course. Uh, I'm not sure if this is a college. I think it might be a college. They have some nice buildings and stuff. I think it's definitely a college at least. Maybe some, it's something. I'm not sure what it is could be some christian thing or something I'm, I'm not sure but we're gonna go get some breakfast over at this little breakfast spot they got and then we're gonna go hit a practice round out here at pitelands i figured i'd just bring you guys along uh you know show you guys a little bit of a little bit of what we're doing today uh, i guess i'll give you guys just a quick uh recap on uh the deglow weekend so uh first day I didn't, I shot pretty good, not the best, you know. I, I definitely hit some good circle twos that first day that kept me in it. And uh, yeah, I didn't, didn't shoot the best, didn't shoot the worst. I think I was like plus two or one that first day, which was a thousand rated, it was like thousand two. And then I kind of shit the bed, shot like plus nine the second day, just was like, my throwing was off, plus my putting was off. And so it didn't really feel like that bad. I just kind of like, it just kept stacking. And every time I did get birdie putts, that would like, maybe bring me back down closer to even to like two or three up i would just miss them so like i had the chances to get back to even i just didn't connect that second day it just kind of kept stacking some bad throwing plus some bad putting but i didn't throw that worst or you know putt the worst it was just kind of it didn't come together really that second day so shot bad but was still like 969 or something so not too below my rating and then uh last day i shot plus like three or something like that which was 997, definitely not bad, not a thousand, it was close. So I only shot 1,000 rated ground this weekend, this past weekend, which is, it's good. You know, you gotta take the wins when you can get them. But yeah, kept a good positive mindset all weekend. That's really all that matters. Just gotta keep going with the with the good mindset. And that, that's what you need to really work on, right? Like, I mean, yes, you're always gonna work on the physical stuff, but nobody mentions the mental side of it, right? And the mental battles. And so it's like, you gotta work on being positive to yourself uh you know just just the little things that help you play better you got to work on those up here right so it's like you got to take the wins where you can get them you know you might not always shoot the best on the course but if you can keep a good positive mindset and a good attitude i've i feel like that's a win for me so that's that's the kind of mindset i've been looking at it you know if i try my fucking absolute best don't give away any stupid fucking strokes and uh keep a positive mindset you can't complain on a where you end up so yeah that's pretty much it for the little recap we're gonna go get out here and get after it for you guys maybe show you the breakfast sandwich i don't know we'll see when we get there I'm really trying to park it. I ain't trying to do nothing else. Nothing else? What the hell's wrong with my zoom? Okay, there we go. Get in? I mean, eighth I'd be willing to do that. Mmm. Okay, too long with a walk up. Mmm. Alright, you ready, baby? 
All right, y'all saw it. Whole, what, four, 316. I'm gonna try a double hunt. She gone. Not a bad shot, but not the best. It could be right there. It could be, you never know. I thought I was at the bin. Mm. Yeah, I looked away and I lost it, but it's probably right there. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Can you keep it rolling? Ooh, it's pretty here. Okay. Baby blue illusion here. Yeah, should be an easy upshot from there. Not bad though. Huh. <laughs> What's the sign looking like? 358. Oh, 17, shit. kind of up and to the left. What I've noticed about these T signs is that it says it's gradually left, but it means it's about 50 more feet left than you think. Oh, shit. Okay, I got <clears throat> purple, yellow, and white. I'm stick that. You got me? It's still rolling. All right, so we got 358. I'm gonna try and go with this inside route on some ante, and then once it gets past the inside route, I think I saw the basket over there. It needs to like shoot left, so. Not bad. Not great. It's okay. We'll keep it rolling. Just do it to the best of your ability. Straight, straight or are we going to go around? We're going to find out. We're going to learn today. came out of my hand early. I should have dried it off. It was all dusty. It was all big body bins. I still got an orange one though. Big body bins. Remember, I used to be dusty. It's okay. It's not a bad thing. I want to go get him. Run, Force! Help me. All right, we got it a baby blue illusion here. Ooh, it went so far. That was great. Yay. Thank you. Thank you. She didn't want to film that, but she did because she's so sweet and she's so, look how sweet this, look how sweet this titty is. She's a, she's what we call a sweet titty, titikins. Off of that, oh, oh, oh. How are you feeling right now? Like I just want one throw where I'm not recording. Okay, just one throw? Yeah. 